U.S. soccer elimination game versus Ghana this afternoon and Nashville fans dressed up and ready for it. This was the scene at Sam's Sports Bar in Hillsborough Village. Not a single seat to be found. The standing room only crowd making a ton of noise knowing in this game every shot and opportunity could be the difference maker. Plenty of red, white, and blue and American camaraderie and the true joy of watching something like this with a crowd. You're celebrating the whole emotion as you're watching it. You can really feel everyone's pulling for this. Like we actually bought these root suits last night, got them overnight, and, and then you got the, got the freaking American flags this morning. It's just about finding an excuse to celebrate. It's about showing spirit. America's soccer has really been picking up lately. As you can tell, like they're actually broadcasting all the games. We made out a group play. We tied England. I mean, like we're really picking up. We really have to support that. I feel it's important as, as much as the fans as it is the players. But the Roars can't stop what has haunted the U.S. All-World Cup, the early deficit. Ghana with the goal, and they take the 1-0 lead. Right so there. it's back to fighting back mode. Robbie Finley with the great opportunity Finley here, but no, nope, stopped by the Ghana goalie, keeps it 1-0. Then with about 30 minutes left in the match, the face of the American team, Landon Donovan, gets the penalty kick. He scores. Off that inside post, perfect, and it's one to one. We go to 30 minutes of extra time, and Ghana strikes quickly again. The U.S. can't respond, and it's over. Ghana wins it two to one. The United States World Cup is now over.